and I'm here with uh, Glenn Bisignani and uh, Jared Spool and Robert Huckman and Glenn's gonna ask some questions of these two guys back here. So the deal is, is that uh, Robert and Jared are working on a new book called Web Anatomy. Could you guys tell us a little bit about that? So uh, Web Anatomy is kind of along the lines of like what a design pattern book would be, uh -huh. but totally different because design patterns uh, solve very, very little tiny problems, very specific problems. Uh, they're sort of out of context. So the idea behind what a web anatomy, when anatomy, I'm an anatomy, when an anatomy, web anatomy, is that uh, instead of looking at little tiny problems out of context, we're going to look at whole problems that are in context. Mm -hmm. So like instead of a, a pagination interface at the bottom of a search results page, which would be a design pattern, we're going to look at the search system itself as a design framework. Um, and basically how applications and sites sort of break down into these repeatable frameworks that are like guidelines, you know, that, that, that pretty much every site out there uses or, you know, very successful sites use time and time again. They're very repeatable patterns um, that you can go sort of look at and assess and pull design criteria out of. So basically uh, the goal of Web Anatomy is to um, sort of document some of those significant frameworks and make the case for frameworks and then uh, and to introduce them, of course. Uh, and then also to show how um, you can pull design criteria out of those frameworks to then come up with new solutions for things and also offers examples for uh, new and innovative and exciting uh, versions that meet the same goals. Huh. Yeah, we're like Penn and Teller, and he does all the time. And there are naked pictures. I don't actually talk. <laughs> <laughs> I gave you your shot, man. <laughs> you did. You did. You did. No, the framework thing is very cool. We call it web anatomy because uh, anatomically things work together, right? Your digestive system produces uh, uh, nutrients and oxygen that's taken into your circulatory system, which is then taken into your respiratory system. All your systems work together. Same is true of frameworks. He knows more about this. All than the I do. And, I, and I haven't written a word. And all the <laughs> frameworks uh, um, uh, work together. So you, you can't just have search on a site without all the other things that go with the rest of the site. So where those things connect together is really important, and that's what we're going to talk about. So tell us about uh, South by Southwest. Um, what are you finding uh, new or exciting at this year's show? I, I, I'm very excited uh, about the, uh, the program, actually. There's a lot of good stuff on the program uh, for South by, and one of the, one of the things that, that uh, I'm looking forward to is uh, Nate Silver's talk to her. You know who Nate Silver is? I don't. Nate Silver he was sounds the, like a rock star. Was the brain was behind uh, 538.com, which basically predicted the results of the election. Oh, nice. Beautifully. And, and so he's giving the keynote tomorrow, so I'm very excited. 